Good morning, Sylvia. Good morning. Hi, my name is Mary. I'm a student nurse from CVTC, and I'm here to give you your eardrops, okay? okay. Um, I'm just gonna wash my hands really quick. All right, and what would you like me to uh, refer to you as? Sylvia. Sylvia, okay, very good, and that's what we'll do. Okay, just giving my, all right, very good. Can I just check your um, name band there? And if you could give me your full name and date of birth, that would be excellent. Sylvia Vasquez, 130-1966. Very good. And do you have any allergies that you're aware of, Sylvia? No allergies. Okay, good. That's what my um, medication record shows. Okay, so today we're gonna go ahead and give you your um, ear drops. Mm -hmm. um, I will be giving it, um, the order does say in the right ear. Mm -hmm. um, so we're just going to apply it in your right ear today. Oh, Does yeah, that sound correct? Mm -hmm. Okay. So before I begin, I'm just going to ask you a few questions. Do you have any um, pain in your ear today? Yep. Okay. Any fullness, congestion? Just a little fullness. I think I have some wax. In okay. There. Good. Any ringing in your ear? Mm -hmm. Okay. No? All's good? Very good. And as I externally assess the ear, I don't see any redness, swelling, or drainage coming out of the ear. So everything looks great. To begin though, I'm gonna to have to lower your bed so that we can put the eardrops in without draining back out. Okay. So I'm just gonna um, put the side rail down first so that I can have easy access. And then I'm gonna go ahead and lower your bed and, um, sorry, sorry, sorry. All right, there we go, a little bit more. Um, do you have any difficulty laying flatter? Okay, good. All right, I think that should be okay. Maybe a little bit lower. All right, good. All right, so if you were having, if she was having shortness of breath, I wouldn't want to put her very low because that would make it more difficult for her to, um, to make, to breathe as she's laying flat. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and have you um, turn that way. And the pillow is fairly flat. So if the pillow was very high, I would want to take that out as well, but we're, we'll be okay. All right, so, um, I did my first two checks at the um, Pixis for my Debrox eardrops, and I'm gonna do my third check here at the bedside um, with my scanning system. All right, so I will do that, and we're just checking the expiration date. So I'm gonna go ahead and put my gloves on before I proceed. All right. Very good. All right, again, I'm going to make sure that I have a Kleenex handy. All right, and since Sylvia is a adult patient, what I would be doing is I would be pulling her pina of her ear up and back before I would administer the drops. So you can zoom in on that, up and back. Okay, very good, okay. All right, Sylvia, so here I am. I'm gonna go ahead and put your eardrops in. Okay. And you're gonna be trying not to touch the... I'm just gonna put a few in there. Good. So we're gonna let those sit in there. If tolerated, she should be able to sit this way for like five minutes. And then you can put a little pressure on the tragus right here, just to keep it in. Okay, good. All right. All right, and if you do feel like she can't lay for five minutes that way, then we, would, we could put a cotton, piece of cotton just in the outer part of the um, ear and have that sit in there so it doesn't drain out, okay? How is that for you? Real good? Okay, great. So I would have her sit for five minutes. So we'll pretend five minutes went by and she can turn back to me, okay? Everything okay? Mm -hmm. All right, good. Any any burning or stinging with that? Nope. Okay, good. I'm just gonna go ahead and remove my gloves. All right, I'm gonna document that I gave the medication. So make sure you put the time you gave it, which ear you put it in, the drops in, and make sure all that is documented. Okay, very good. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the side rail up for safety and I'm gonna put um, Sylvia's head up again like she had it. Is that comfortable or would you like mm -hmm. it more? Nope, that's okay, good. that's good. All right, you have your call light right mm -hmm. here. So if you need me, you can go ahead and ring the call light. Make sure bed is locked and those side rails are up. Make sure everything's safe in the room. Sylvia looks comfortable. I will, um, I will just let you know, you let me, 
call your call me if you feel like you have any burning or stinging or pain in that ear after i gave that okay, okay. Mm -hmm. and if that helped out that fullness feeling okay so i'll okay. be back to reassess that probably okay. in about an hour or so but if you need anything before that let me know all right well thank you sylvia for allowing me to administer your eardrops today thank you.